Good morning, Council Members. Mike Colon uh, I do live on Waikiki Beach, and I keep on hearing homeless, homeless. You know, we're not, we're houseless. Uh, affordable housing. I cannot get my own place for $350 a month. And since you guys passed the law for YTT, there are people that do work. You know, some of us do, do, you know, there are drug addicts and alcoholics out there, and some people don't, you know. And I'm one of them, and I can afford it, you know. Uh, they say uh, public services are coming out to Waikiki Beach. In the last, say, year and a half, I got one piece of paper that says call IHS. You know, uh, they made a big thing on the news that you guys came out and started helping us. You know, I wasn't, I was there, and I got one piece of paper, you know. The answer, I think, is just housing. We need more affordable housing. And there are, excuse me, I am nervous. Uh, there are mentally ill out there. They need help, you know, more than I do. And you, you can't just keep on criminalizing us. We're not criminals, you know. It's hard out there, you know. Any of you guys come out there for two days and see what we go through. You know, can you live off of $350 a month, you know? I can't. And a waiting list for Section 8 is anywhere from two to five years, you know? Well, I have to wait that long for it, you know? I am disabled. I can't work in the meantime right now. I just... Without my family, I couldn't survive out there. You know, by the grace of God, I have my sister and my friends, and I have a lot of support, you know? That's the only way I can survive. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your testimony. Members, any questions for the testifier? Not. Thank you, sir. Thank you for coming forward.